Hi Gemini, long time no see. Welcome to your June 2022 astrology forecast. For those of you who are new to my channel, I talk everything around astrology and tarot. Do remember to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell. It will allow me to create more content for you. So Geminians, um, happy birthday for uh, a lot of you. And uh, we have uh, quite a fabulous month with a little bit of a rocky uh, phases in between as well. We have Jupiter and Mars that are doing a fabulous waltz this entire month. We also have Mercury, your ruling planet, that goes direct. So that's like a breath of fresh air. We also have Saturn that is going direct. Now Saturn tends to go retrograde, stationary retrograde once every year. It goes, does that for about four and a half months. But the lessons that Saturn tends to teach us are quite powerful. And for you, those lessons have been there in... Uh, long distance travel in your spiritual growth and also expanding your mind. So uh, this is a time where uh, you could be questioning your own belief system, you could be questioning your value system, you could be seeing as to how it is that uh, they are impacting your life. It can be that, you know, say for example that you've been told a certain thing by your parents, uh, you know, that you need to be in a certain way, you need to be behaving in a certain way, you need to be uh, you know, being always very kind to your siblings and uh, you have experienced uh, hypothetically a very toxic relationship with your sibling and that goes absolutely, uh, you know, opposite to what you are bringing or what is it that you have taught. So Saturn is going to be making you question all of that and also certain decisions that you may feel that where certain friendships are concerned that you may have been very hasty in judging. So you could be uh, for some of you, you could almost abandon your faith temporarily and you could feel, um, you know, a little low during this uh, Saturnian phase. You may sort of question people around you, your upbringing, your values, your parents and uh, the entire patterns that are there and uh, just have a sense of, you know, wanting to block it and not wanting to deal with it. But uh, it is also a good time to be learning newer things as hard as it may be Geminian and irrespective of how old you are it's a great time to be uh, maybe going back to school going back to college picking up a course it's a great time to be even as far as spiritual learning is concerned if there's something that has really drawn you to a certain faith to a certain religion a certain learning it's a great time to be deepening it. It's a great time to be digging deeper and understanding as to why is it that you feel in a certain way, do or how are, how and why are certain things that the way that they are. Uh, for some of you, it can be that travel has been a slightly uh, sort of difficult uh, part. Maybe something or the other has kept on getting cancelled for you. And now with the with Saturn going direct, with Mercury going direct from the 5th, uh, things will open up. They can be that there are more negotiations, travel becomes more easy, your visas come out more smoother. And uh, there's just going to be this sense of uh, being more accepted in the world at large. We also have a full moon on the 14th and this is there in your house of relationship. This is the house of marriage and something is coming to an end. Maybe there is a confrontation that you've been having with your partner. Uh, this also comes to, uh, brings to light maybe around a, a partnership, a business partnership maybe is coming to an end. Maybe for the longest you have thought that this collaboration would work but it is coming to an end. In certain cases, it could be that you're leaving a job. Uh, in some cases, it could also be that you're just simply finishing a project. We have your ruling uh, planet Mercury that is moving into your own sign on the 14th and in your own house. So you're going to be feeling quite chatty, uh, Geminians. You would want to talk about everything under the sun, about your plans, about your goals, how it is that you see your life, where it is that you want to be in your life. It's a wonderful time to be writing. It's a good time to be journaling, Geminian. So if you have thought uh, about, uh, you know, if there have been things that have been bothering you and you do not believe in going to going for counseling for whatever reason, I think therapists are fabulous. But for whatever reason, if you do not believe in that, it's a absolutely wonderful time to start journaling as well. On the 22nd, we have uh, 
son that moves into your uh, house of uh, income this is your own income and also it speaks about yourself also it can be that uh, some of you are picking up another job a second job maybe you're creating another source of revenue for yourself and uh, you could be also feeling quite secure because you seem to be having some more uh, disposable income uh, with you and uh, this is also could be increasing your own sense of self-worth because you're able to purchase and buy more things out of that uh, you are also going to be feeling quite grounded and quite practical with more uh, wealth uh, I think which is a natural thing the more money in the bank and the more for some of us uh, we do feel more secure the 23rd we have Venus that is there in your own house as well it joins Mercury so again fabulous pleasurable interactions with people good positive communications wonderful financial opportunities as well and then we close the month on the 29th with a new moon that is there in your house of earned income so uh, this speaks about a new opportunity maybe some of you are looking at starting a business with a, a friend a partner maybe some of you are looking at um, starting a new job a new project and uh, some of you have picked up that second job overall it also focuses on your own sense of self worth how it is that you see your own self and a lot of times when um, this specific house lights up it speaks about our own um, our own innate desire to equate our sense of um, a sense of worth with the amount of money that we have in a bank so this is the time you're going to be feeling fabulous because money seems to be overflowing you seem to be in a really good space as far as money is concerned for those of you who are struggling it is a good time to be creating that second source of income or even to be picking up a second uh, job for yourself it's been a pleasure speaking with you Geminians do remember to please subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell it will allow me to create more content for you i'll see you soon and thank you so much for watching